I'm Sandy Burns with RVTravel.com and I'm going to show you how you can make a portable backup camera for your RV. A lot of vehicles nowadays are coming with backup cameras, which makes hitching up to a ball type hitch a snap. But what if you're hitching up to a fifth wheel and, like me, you can't actually see your hitch from the driver's seat? Or maybe you're backing into a campsite solo and you want to make sure your RV isn't about to hit a tree. With a few hours and a bit of know-how, you can take a regular 12-volt camera that is designed to be wired into your vehicle's backup system and turn it into a portable camera. This camera is designed to be wired into the backup system and it sends a signal wirelessly to a screen which you mount on the dashboard inside your vehicle. What we've done here instead is we've uh, hooked it up to two 6-volt batteries and we're using a toggle switch to turn it on, on and off. This system was designed and built by a family friend by the name of Jim Howe. Before we get started, here's what you're going to need. Two 6 volt dry cell batteries, 16 gauge coated wire, black for negative and either red or yellow for positive, four alligator clips, two connectors, a container, mine comes from the dollar store and is waterproof, a strap, a toggle switch, a piece of wood or plastic, and pop rivets or small nuts and bolts. The first thing you need to do is to drill two holes on the bottom of your container to allow any moisture that gets inside to drain out. Then put your batteries in and connect the wires in series. You will now have 12 volts. The wire is soldered to the alligator clips to hold them in place and the connections are soldered together. Position the toggle switch and the camera above the batteries and drill a hole into the container to attach them from the outside. To make these pieces more secure, add a piece of wood or plastic to the inside of your container and attach them to both. Attach a strap to the container using pop rivets or small nuts and bolts. Stuff a plastic bag or a sponge beside and on top of the batteries to hold everything in place. Do not use any fabric as it might mildew if it gets wet. Here are a few things to keep in mind when you're putting this together. The camera is not designed for continuous use. Turn it off when you're done. If you leave it on, it will burn out the transmitter. Don't cut the wire that came with the camera. You might accidentally cut the aerial and then it won't work. Before securing the camera in place, test to make sure it is not being installed upside down. Identify your wires. We used masking tape and a marker. This makes it easier when it comes time to replace the batteries. I find having a portable backup camera has made hitching up and backing up a lot safer and easier, and I hope you do too. Good luck and happy camping.